Hey guys, got another video here for you on how to bypass the Windows uh, product activation. This is uh, called the Windows XP Infinite Loop of Doom. Basically, what happens is you boot the system up, and uh, this is what you're greeted with. You can't log on to the system, and uh, you may be getting trouble to actually activate your product key, uh, and you can't get your data off or something like that. Okay, and this is just one of the ways of going about it. If you go to my forums, you'll see a few other different ways of going about this uh, same issue. Okay, so uh, what I'm going to do here is close this off, and as you see, I'm going to reboot the system into safe mode, and you'll see the same thing pop up there. So let me just reboot the system into safe mode. Okay, so I want to be pushing F8 on my keyboard to enter safe mode with networking or safe mode, either one of these it will still do the same thing and I'll quickly load this in so you can see we'll have the same scenario like so. So now we can't get on the system we're locked out. Okay, as you can see. So I'll show you a quick way around it anyway. So what we're going to do is reboot into safe mode with command prompt. Okay, so I'll reboot the system. Again keep tapping F8 on the keyboard when you reboot the system. And what I want to do here is I want to go into safe mode with command prompt. And then I'm going to push enter here. This will load this uh, command prompt window up in safe mode. Okay, so we're at the uh, command prompt window now. And we're still in safe mode as you can see down the bottom here. So what I want to do is explore. Or explorer.exe. And then uh, go to desktop and say yes to this. And as you can see, it's loaded up the desktop. We can now close this window off. And here you can see we have all our files. So we have access to our data. So that's the way around it. So let's have a little look at the run bar here. And what I want to do is type run. DLL32.exe and then I want to do a space and then I want to do sys setup then a comma then a capital S okay it must be exactly the same otherwise it won't work setup and then O capital O that is and another small O I will put this in the description and then a capital B and then NK so that's how it should look like that okay and then push OK or enter like so then we're going to reboot the system into normal mode now And hopefully, we should have now 30 days left on our trial. There you go. We've just renewed the 30 day trial by doing that one command. And then we're back up our normal desktop now. And we can now register our product key uh, the proper way. And we're at our desktop and back all our data up. Hope you enjoy these videos. My name is Brian from brightech.co.uk. If you enjoy these videos, please remember, guys, hit that subscribe button, show your support. If you want to see more videos like this, then uh, just drop me a message what you want to see, and I'll make that video for you. Okay? Please remember, guys, rate and favorite all my videos, and uh, I'll be making more videos in the future. So I'll see you guys later. Thanks again for watching, guys. Bye for now.